Okay, I just had this arrive today. This is the Port-a-Pro. I believe it is pronounced Timo. It might also be Timo. I'm not really sure. But I've seen this on multiple different social media outlets with influencers using it, showing how they're using it in their car to do their hair and how it is completely cordless. You plug it into a typical USB outlet. It charges this entire Porta Pro device. And they're saying that it is lightweight, easy to just kind of throw down in your purse to touch up your hair on the go or also while you're traveling. Now that little piece that I just showed on the end, you do have to remove that before you start using it, which is where the USB plug is because they said that they need that to be out. And then when it's traveling, you put that plug in and then that's what they're calling it in fly mode or travel mode. This is my daughter. I, she has naturally kind of wavy hair when you let it dry and it's wet unless you brush it out. And then it kind of looks like this. It kind of looks like it wants to have been curly at one point but then it just looks like you need to straighten it or do something else with it because it's just a frizzy mess. Now, I do recommend that you brush whoever's hair, your hair, your child's hair, whoever you're using this on, brush the hair out and get all of the knots out because this does heat up really hot. And I know that there's a lot of people saying like, oh, this is great. You could even let your kids use it. I would be hesitant to let my kids use this. Now, she's only seven right now. Uh, so I don't really like letting her use any kind of hot tools like this, but I still would not let her use this one uh, while some people were saying that it, oh, you can even let kids use it because it's not going to, you know, hurt them. They can't put their hand on the hot kind of part that's down underneath those bristles that you're brushing through because the actual hot plate on this is underneath the bristles. However, this was burning my hand. Uh, towards the end of me doing this because the hair gets so incredibly hot. That's another thing that I did see people doing. I saw that they were curling their hair with this by twisting it. You're going to see in just a second that I tried to do that with her hair, trying to do that like typical twist that you can do with a flat iron to get a curl. And this was just kind of getting stuck in her hair and it wasn't really working. So right here, I start trying to twist and then pull it through and it was really just kind of getting stuck. And she does not have very thick, coarse hair. She does have very fine hair. So I was a little disappointed that it wasn't really working no matter what I was trying and trying to get it to curl. So this is really only working on straightening hair at my house because we all kind of have hair like this. Um, now I will say that after a couple of brushes through, it did work really nicely overall in trying to get her hair straight, making it look like it had actually been fixed. It was more manageable and it had a little bit of sleekness to it, especially on the ends because her hair really is, it just looks like a, a hot mess unless you do something with it or pull it back. So for on the go, I think that this really is a great little device. I probably will take it with us on our Disney trip. Uh, you know, and if she wants her hair straightened or wants it to be fixed, then, you know, to go to dinner or something after we've been at the park all day, then I can even do it, you know, in the Minnie Mouse car that we ride in to dinner, you know, on the go. And we're not having to sit in the hotel room while I fix her hair. I can do it while we are physically on our way to somewhere. So that is a big plus to me. I also have a USB-C charger in my car, so I could charge this in my car at any time and then also be able to use it. So, and for travel, I'll always have a USB-C cable while we're traveling to be able to charge this if it needed to be charged. You can use it fully plugged in or off of the charger. So for me, I think this was a worth it purchase on my end because we will definitely be using it.